Alright, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be watching House of the Dragon Episode 4. Now, in the last episode, I, I misunderstood what was happening. I will be completely honest. I, I didn't realize what they meant at a certain point in the show. He hasn't officially made Aegon the heir to the throne yet, but... It, he's kind of expected to like everyone want like everyone's just expecting him to because you know he's the he's the male and nobody really expects a female to be on the iron throne so but as it currently stands Rhaenyra is the heir right now Otto said he he made a suggestion to Viserys right and I thought oh okay he just want he wants Viserys to make Aegon the heir to the throne now even though he's two years old like okay I thought that's what he meant at first but nope, I completely misunderstood. I, I misunderstood that completely. So what he actually meant was have Aegon marry Rhaenyra. Sorry, that, that sorry, like that that wasn't the first thing I thought of when he he said it, you know. But it's because everyone, every other house, like Jason Lannister, that fucking prick, he's trying to marry Rhaenyra, like he's, because obviously they want to join houses, get that power, you know, like I, I totally get why he's trying to do it. But obviously Rhaenyra is like pissed off that like every, every dude's trying to fucking marry her. She's like, fuck off, like leave me alone, basically. And so Viserys was telling that to Otto. And so that's why Otto suggests that works in Otto's favor because it keeps him, that makes sure Aegon will become the king, right? And Otto will have that power still. That's that's what Otto wants. That's why he had Alicent, his daughter, seduce Viserys, you know, kind of make him feel comfortable when his wife first died and his first son, Balin, first died, you know? And then eventually he had a kid with her. So Otto wants to do everything he possibly can to make sure Aegon is the heir and he becomes king because then Otto will be in a very comfortable position. Now, on the flip side of it, um, okay, you know what's really clutch right now? This family tree I'm looking at. This is clutch as hell right now. Okay, so house. Uh, this dude from House Strong, uh, Linnell, I think that's how you pronounce it. Not exactly sure, but he was given advice to Viserys, and he recommended that he ha that Rhaenyra's best choice for marriage would be Lanira Valerian. Right? I th I think that's how you pronounce his first name. I I apologize if it's not. These are all very new names to me, but which okay because that's actually a very very strong choice because that would actually that would combine strengths with the house of corliss valerian that would you know because that's what he wanted in episode two but he had a different I approach to it he wanted the series to marry lanira lanira his fucking 12 year old daughter and the series is like nah nah you know but this way the houses could still unite together so i think that works out pretty well now speaking of Corlys, he's with Demon right now, and they're off like fighting the Crab King. Which so there was a two-year time jump from the second episode to the third, and for the last I think they said for the last six months they've been at war with this Crab King, and Demon finally killed him, right? So I guess that war's over now. So that's that's cool. So for this episode, I'm expecting another time jump. I'm not sure how long it is, but we'll find out pretty soon, I imagine. So. Anyways, I'm gonna stop wasting time. We're just gonna hop right into this episode. If you'd like to watch the full and three action, that'll be available on Patreon as well early access to the next two episodes. Oh wait, no, never mind, because I'm going straight to YouTube with this. Uh early access to Game of Thrones will be available on Patreon. So, anyways, let's get started. Oh, and also in the last episode, the series did give Rhaenyra the freedom to choose who she wants to marry, so I guess that's what she's doing right now. She's going through people who would make a good fit i guess that's like i'm guessing that's why there's a line of just boys in front of her you think my great grandmother is beautiful as they say yeah and this guy's trying to make a case for the next boy and everything the man is older than my father <laughs> it's unseemly for him to put himself forward as a contender for my hand yeah okay you're like fucking 11 no i'm now a child yeah see no let me go to supper Raven. Uh, oh, yes, kill him. Yes, come on. She that steal you twat. Ah. Uh, princess, would you invent a virgin? Okay, my boys put her in a work at least. Landing if a bought an end to this ridiculous pageant. <gasps> Who died? Who died? Who died? <gasps> yes! Yes! Fuck that fool. 
Kinda okay. looks like Freddy from like Harley. Damn, my boy put it into work. <laughs> He's like, talk that shit now, huh? Still can't believe just like how casual it is just to kill someone in this day and age. <laughs> like what? Take him oh no, 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 no. <gasps> oh, it's, what? It's a fucking Damon just being a menace. Returning to the Red Keep. It looked like Damon's dragon, but I could be wrong on that. It's Damon. Yep. <laughs> oh, Damon got a haircut. I was about to say, he looked a little different. Put it to the chair. <laughs> they name me King of the Narrow Sea. Hmm. But I know that there is only one true king, your grace. No, that's you. Ah. Okay. My crown and the stepstones are yours. Ah. Okay. Okay. Respect. The realm owes you a great debt, brother. Mm. Those men and boys don't fawn over me. They only want my name and my Valyrian blood for their offspring. Yep. <laughs> The king went through great effort to arrange your tour. Yeah, and she rejected everyone, so he's... Yeah, he's all pissed. What anyone sees when they look at me now is... The queen. Okay, fucking brag. I, the f fuck? <laughs> A subtle flex so far, okay. Not even subtle, that was just thrown in my face. <laughs> Why did you come back? There's surely more for your return than simply taunting my father. Though I do suppose you seem changed by your adventures. Mm-hmm. That's my mother was made to, the, to produce heirs until it killed her. I once subject myself to the same fate. You cannot live your life in fear or you will forsake the best parts of it. I have no desire to live in fear. Only solitude. Certainly he cannot still be wroth. He is. ...to wed his daughter Lena to the Sea Lord's son. Okay. We would have to seek our own marriage pact. Okay. So then Rhaenyra would have to marry to counter- She would have to marry to counter their alliance. And so we don't get weaker as they get stronger. I think that's what he was trying- I think that's what he meant. Sleep well, princess. See, she wants her Christian, but it, it'll never happen because he's in the King's Garden. He can't- he swore. He can't. What are those? Someone else's clothes? Ah, uh, it's a hidden doorway. Alright, bit. Oh, Damon left the clothes in the note so she can meet him here. Okay, duh. And so, yeah, the clothes so they wouldn't be recognized. Bro, it's a lit out here. <laughs> It's probably one of the first times she's ever left the castle too and really explored and that's why Damon's showing her what's really like out outside. Oh, I've given her some wine. <laughs> yeah, Damon, Damon's the fun uncle for sure. Oh my god, his fucking... His pinky and his ring finger are fucked. Oh, it's like a little down here too now. Bro, they cut his... Wait, yeah, did they cut half his fingers off? That's what it looks like. A girl! His heir! Uh, yeah, and now, uh, now she sees that everyone hates it. Now she really see, now she's really gonna see what the public thinks of her. And this is a play. Yeah, this is a play mocking it. Aegon should be the heir. Yeah. Mm. They want her of no consequence. <laughs> yep. Before Copper Street Rat in King's Landing, we pay for our pleasures. Hey! Wow. Stop! Boy! Wait, I'll find him. Oh my god. Yeah, you gotta pay for that shit, Rhaenyra. She's not used to that. I'm surprised no one recognized them. I mean, would it be like... Is it a common thing to know their faces? You know, I, fi I figured the public would know what Rhaenyra and Daemon look like. I mean, you can't really see them because they're disguised, but like, still, I guess. Oh, well, you got me fucked. Princess. Yep. You take care, boy. Next time you might not be so lucky. Yeah. He doesn't want to be with Damon. 
And she said, don't. You know what? Okay, you know why I think people aren't recognizing them? It's because they're used to seeing them all dressed up, all look nice and pretty. And they're you know, royal outfits and everything and presented in front of you. So when they're just in the street, kind of like not even like that disguised, you're not even going to recognize them because it doesn't click. It doesn't register in your head because you don't even know them personally enough to recognize them when they're dressed like that. But I hope that makes sense. The king has requested your presence. Oh, no. The hour is quite late. Yes, your grace. Yeah, is it an emergency? Oh, that's what he wanted. Okay. Wow. Why did, why did Damien take her to a brothel? Bro, is he trying to fuck her? Like, what's going on? <gasps> no! Ew, ew. Bro, come on. That doesn't stop us from doing what we want. Bro, it's fucking what we want. Damien, what are you? Bro, come on. That's your fucking niece. <sighs> Alright, bro. This is... <laughs> Damon? Just walked away from her. Just straight up fucking rejected her and went, like, why? What? Yeah, it's just some sort of play to get her to fall in love with him, and then he. <laughs> like, I wouldn't even say that's a stretch, bro, for this show. Like, is this just a power play by him? Yeah. Yeah, he's like, where the fuck did you go? I thought you were in here the entire time. <laughs> I thought you. <laughs> Jesse, you, you hurt. Not physically, but emotionally. <gasps> oh, yeah, she wants to fuck him. Because Damon's like, we fuck who we want, you know? Like, we fuck whoever we want. So she's gonna try and do it to him. Is he gonna fold, though? Let's see. I would I would have grabbed it. Oh, shit. Stop. What a guy, dude. I can't do this. And then she's just gonna want it even more. <sighs> Bro, she's gonna get him killed. Alright, he folded. <laughs> Pretty sure it's like against his vows to have sex though. Apologies for late hour, my lord. What is it? So he's probably gonna get in trouble later. On. White worm. If they get caught. Oh, this little fucking kid. No, he's gonna snitch on them. He saw Renewer in the streets. With Damon, like after she ran after Damon out of the the brothel or whatever. Fuck. <laughs> Damon fell asleep in a goddamn barn. <laughs> the skin tray could only take me so far in this life. Oh no. Wait, wait. Why is he why why is he paying her? What the fuck? Oh, it looks like he doesn't want to do what he's about to do. I have um, discomforting news. I thought it best shared discreetly before the council could be. All the kid, uh, all the kid could really say is he saw Rhaenyra and Damon leaving the brothel late at night. That's really it. I had considered saying nothing, but what has she done? They were engaged in behaviors unbecoming of a maiden. How does the kid know that? The kid was out. The kid was outside. He didn't see them do what they did inside, but I guess, I guess they assumed. What must I say to your grace? You enter my bedchamber, accusing my daughter of something. Mm. Now speak it <laughs> plainly. Do it <laughs> for serious. You know what he's trying to say, but he wants to hear it for himself. You know. Coupling. Yep. This is a lie. Yeah, if the series is like bullshit, but... As your hand, I must maintain trusted sources of information, and this one as yet has never led me astray. The little kid. I'm sick with ambition that you would have my daughter stalked, hmm? spied upon, awaiting your best chance to destroy her reputation. Mm-hmm. I have no such intent. You're bullshit. Do you wish to have your blood on the Iron Throne so badly that you are willing to destroy mine own? Viserys doesn't believe it because he's like, you know, like Rhaenyra and Damon never. But I mean, it, Viserys is right though. That's what Otto does want. He wants his own blood on the Iron Throne. I don't want to cut him off, but he. I did hear Otto say like, I consider not telling you. Like, oh, bro, I wasn't gonna tell you, but I respect you so much. I'm gonna tell you. Like, shut the fuck off. You know, he pulled one of those. He, okay, like even if Viserys 
Okay, I'm for the series just sounds like he's just not believing it because yeah, that's it's gonna ruin the reputation. So he's like, no, this isn't true. Get the fuck out of my face. And really, all you have is just someone's word, and that's really it. There's no there's no way to actually prove it. So unless you you know, it's really just oh, I trust my source. In this case, Otto's trust this fucking ten year old kid. You know, princess. I I have a message from the queen. Hmm. From Allison? She's going to question her. Wait, wait, wait. I have a question, actually. Did Sir Christian pull out, bro? Or did he... Ick. What's good? It's, what's, his, what's his pull out game looking like? Is it a week? I guess we'll find out if her near is pregnant later on, so... I haven't seen him in years. He took me into the city for some fun. Tell hmm. me the whole of it, Rhaenyra. For some fun. But you fucked Damon in a pleasure house. Uh is a vile wait Accus wait i don't think they fucked i don't think they did i mean i wasn't yeah i wasn't really paying attention too hard to that montage such a thing why not because it did not happen he was told told yeah he was just told no th there's no video v video or it didn't happen bro <laughs> virtue is an act of treason mm -hmm. he reported it to the king yep he want to help you rhaenyra Nah, I don't trust Allison here. It's only a spectator. I didn't do anything. Allison does not believe you. Abandoned me for some whole. Mm-hmm. <laughs> You're good. Fuck. Take your fucking hands off me. <laughs> Damon, you finally get back from war and you pull this shit. What the fuck is wrong? I need to understand the charge before I can attempt to discredit it. <laughs> you defiled her. Oof. She's just a girl. Your niece. There is a woman. Mm -hmm. She's your niece. Mm -hmm. You are the dragon. Your word is truth and law. Nor did you. Be done with it. Wed her to me. No. When I offered up my crown, you said I could have anything. I want Rhaenyra. No. Where she is and wed her in the tradition of... No. You are already wed. That didn't stop Egg on the Conqueror from taking a second. Yeah, he doesn't give a fuck. And we will return the house of the dragon to its proper glory. Nah, no. It's not my daughter you lust for. It. It's power. It's my throne. Yep. As long as you are gone from my side for good. Yeah, bro, I, he can't be here anymore. <laughs> See, I knew that was just like a power play. Like he was trying to just. Mm -hmm. By reducing you. Putting under your skin. That dag. <laughs> and his will be the song of ice and fire. Hmm. You guys talk about that a lot. I see the comments about ice and fire, about the, about that a lot. Jaehaerys would have disinherited you. Yep. For a lie, to me, for the truth of what happened. The truth does not matter, Rhaenyra. Only perception. Yep. I could father a dozen bastards, and no one in your court would blink an eye. Yeah, it's unfair. Your courtship is at an end. You will wed Selene of Valarian, mm. and you will do so without protest. Okay. As a naval fleet, no one would dare to stand against us. Yep. The House of the Dragon will stand as one for a further generation. Mm -hmm. And what will you do about the vulture who perches upon your throne? What vulture? Oh, oh, Otto, yeah, 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 yeah. He wants Aegon to be named heir. Yep. Including spying on me to bring about my ruin. Mm-hmm. But how can that be accomplished with your most trusted advisor so self-interested? Every... It is unavoidable. My... Mm, he's aware. But you must first do yours as king. Oof. Fire Otto. Have him killed. Get him the fuck out of here. Five days. I'm sorry, you got five days of pack your shit. I recall it all too well. Yeah. It was a good day for you. Mm hmm. That's hardly how I viewed it, Your Grace. Cab. You went from being another man in Jairus' court to the second most powerful man in the realm. <laughs> wow. How long did it take you to choose yourself over your king? Yep. She was a calculated distraction. I only now realize. How well calculated it. Mm-hmm. Absurdity. The queen loves you. 
No, she doesn't, bro. And must tell his king a discomforting truth from time to time, your great. <gasps> ah, I took it. Both owe you a debt can never be repaid. Mm -hmm. But I can no longer trust your judgment. Dude, he looks devastated. <laughs> I'm sorry, what is that? Yeah. Unwanted consequences. Uh, oh, is this fucking plan B or some shit? Like, is this what it... So she doesn't, like, get Damon's kid, you know? But... Okay, alright. Well, that was episode four. Alright, let's talk about it. Alright, so my memory card filled up last night, so I wasn't able to record an outro, so I'm doing it today. But, that was House of the Dragon, episode four. Now, got a little family drama in this episode. Alright, so Damon took out Rhaenyra. He took her out to the nightlife of the city to kind of get her a little bit more. Ex At first, I thought it was just to expose her more to the nightlife and everything, like what the city's actually like, because I kind of figured, yeah, she probably stays in the castle most of her life. Most of the time, she probably just stays in the castle. I'm like, yeah, she can go out for sure, but, but I figured she wouldn't really explore by herself or she wouldn't be allowed to really explore certain parts of the city and so damon exposed her to that now she really she got to really see what the city thinks of her and yeah no one wants her to be heir no one wants her to be queen one day they all want aegon but then damon took her to a pleasure house and you know i was at first i was like what why why is he taking her here like what like why and then he was like yeah we fuck who we want and then he tried to basically fuck on her you know they they started kissing a little bit but then he was like you know what never mind fuck this but then he's like you know what never mind i'm out of here so he just left and i was kind of like what what why did he stop you know like okay like what this feels so impulsive i like you never know what he's really trying to do but I, but then you know later Allison was like yeah it's probably just because he's trying to get under your skin or whatever but then when he was talking to Viserys in the um, in the throne room he was like make he's like ha he was like have me wed Rhaenyra or whatever so he, yeah he just he just wants a throne you know like everyone wants the goddamn throne so but it didn't work Viserys is like no fuck yourself you need to leave so so he's gonna banish him again so it's like okay but then Otto had a spy you know on them and he saw the spy reported the auto yeah they're leaving the pleasure house or whatever so yeah you kind of have to assume that's what ha like yeah they fucked in there when they didn't but you kind of just have to assume that they did because like why else would they be in there or whatever and so Otto went to go tell the series that he saw them leaving or whatever but then he saw it in a different way he was like okay wait why do you even have spies on them in the first place why do you like are you trying to find anything to ruin the reputation you know and that's exactly what he's trying to do get him and so it pretty much backfired on Otto after that and then and then later in the episode Viserys was talking to Rhaenyra about it and yeah Rhaenyra pretty much pointed out to him, like Otto's doing this because he has his own self-interest you know and okay Viserys clearly sees it so then he took him he fired his ass he's like you're booted you're out of here give me that shit and I okay I did like how he said like you know the realm does owe you a debt because you did put in work for us but now but then he was like but now I can no longer trust your judgment so give me that shit so okay at least he can respect him in that way because like he was a good hand for a little bit but then you know as he got more power and everything it kind of just like um it, it became more obvious what he's trying to do you know so honestly Viserys should make that other guy the hand of the king now the one who was like the one who's given him solid advice so far I think he should be hand of the king but we'll see if he gets corrupted later down on the line if that does happen because eventually everyone will be corrupted so but that was house of the dragon episode four comment down below what you thought about this episode down below in the comments and if you like the video like the video and thanks for watching